Albinism uh, manifests itself in, in many different ways. Bright lights bother me. I have monocular vision. My eyes have a difficult time keeping straight and focusing. I'm not part of the world visually. Teachers write on a blackboard, and that's fine for most people, but I couldn't see the blackboard. What I had to rely on was books. Being a, a NASA inventor, I've had to prove myself many times. I remember as a young scientist, I was standing in the hall and a senior member criticized the work that I was doing and said, nobody cares about what you're doing. Cardiovascular disease is the largest killer, uh, at least in this country. Pacemakers, of course, send electrical impulses. So if you have a good electric insulator, you can make a thinner insulation material. It also has to be biologically inert so that the human body doesn't attack it. Larkasai had all these qualities. And so because of Larkasai, they could redesign the pacemaker with the goal in mind that once you have the Medtronic uh, pacemaker, it will probably outlive you. Dr. Brian has patience and kindness. He was very, very kind to actually sponsor me to work at NASA. He has something that's very unusual for engineers, which is the ability to explain complex subjects easier. And so he, he's a fantastic salesman. That's very difficult to find, and it's an art. I think of myself in part as a business person. I believe an innovator believes in what they do from invention to getting something into the marketplace. As the inventor of the material, I was the one that was responsible for helping promote the material. How can I take a material that was developed for high-performance aircraft and space applications, how can I get such a material into the general public? Rob went out of his way to explain it to marketing people, business people. So his impact is to inspire people to do more than what they think they can do. You never know where some material is going to end up. A Larkasai pacemaker has been inserted in, in upwards of, say, 700,000 people worldwide. And so you can imagine that, that all these people are not only alive, but are living better lives. And I'm very glad that it has ended up improving lives for people. <laughs>